When the movie starts, a police officer named Hollies is shown. He has come to the hospital to donate sperm because his friend was unable to have a child. But here the doctor tells him that his sperm is of no use, meaning that he can never become a father. Hollies is shocked to hear all this because he had two children, that is, his wife cheated on him, and had an affair with someone else from whom those two children were born. Hollish goes home and talks to his wife. The wife tells that she was not able to have a child, so he did all this to make happy him. But Hollish was still very angry, he could not believe all these things. On the other side of the story, a man named Gavin was about to jump off the terrace of the building to commit suicide. But someone calls the police and informs about him, so Hollies comes to save him. Hollies talks to Gavin and tries to ask why is he doing this. So here Gavin tells that if he does not commit suicide before 12 o'clock then someone else will be killed. When Hollies doesn't understand this, Gavin starts telling what actually happened. Now a few days back is shown in the movie, the building where Gavin lives, so husband and wife named Shauna and Joey shift in him neighborhood. Shauna and Gavin studied in the same school, Gavin works as a manager in a hotel, so Shauna also starts working job there, and they become each other's friends again after many years. Then one day Shauna and Joey invite him for dinner, but when Gavin goes to their house for dinner with his friend Chris, so before starting the dinner there, Joey prays to God and says that he should forgive the sins of Gavin and Chris, because Joey thought they both are gay, but the truth was that only Chris was gay. Joey calls them sinners too, so Gavin gets angry and leaves. That's when Gavin and Chris talk, so Gavin speaks as written in the Bible, people who are gay should be killed. Joey thinks so too, so he must have said so. Now Gavin decides to avenge his humiliation by getting intimate with Joey's wife. The next day, when Shauna meets Chris at the hotel, she says sorry to him. Both of them start talking, so Gavin asks her out to lunch. But the maid working in this hotel knew Shauna's husband, so these people go somewhere else and have lunch. Then on the way home, Shauna starts asking Gavin if he is not married. Gavin tells that he was married, but a few years ago his daughter died in an accident. His wife felt that all this happened because of him. That's why she went away with divorce. Hearing all this, Shauna says that he should move on now. So Gavin says if he starts getting intimate with her then he can move on. Hearing this, Shauna did not say anything. Then the next day when these people are together, so Shauna also tells the story of her past how she met Joey. He was addicted to drugs, so a man had hit her a lot, she had reached the hospital. And there she found Joey who showed her the right path and taught her how to live well. After that they got into a relationship and got married. We then see Gavin sitting on the terrace one night. So then Shauna also comes to him. When these people start talking, they lie down and start looking at the open sky. And then Gavin kisses Shauna. After this, Shauna keeps thinking about Gavin, and the very next day she goes Gavin and asks him to be intimate. Gavin decides to meet at another hotel and sends the details of the hotel to Shauna in the evening. But that SMS Joey also sees, and when Shauna leaves the house saying extra shift. So Joey follows them and sees both of them. He was feeling very bad seeing this, wife is cheating on him. But the next day, Shauna tells Gavin, maybe Joey got to know everything. That's why he is not talking to her much. But still these people are intimate many times without caring for him. But every time Joey also comes to know about it. Now Gavin also falls in love with Shauna. And then one day Shauna says him why don't they both start living together, they both will be very happy. Hearing all this, Gavin also says yes. But the day Shauna was about to leave Joey, so on that day Joe tells that he loves her very much. That's why today wants to give him complete satisfaction by taking him to the hotel. Saying this, he takes Shauna to the hotel and gets intimate. After this, Shauna decides to stay with him for a few more days. Then one day Joey invites Gavin over to the house. He starts speaks a passage written in the Bible, if someone has an affair with someone else after getting married. So they both should be killed. Gavin gets scared when Joey has a gun in his hand. But for now he lets Gavin go, but after some time he calls her and says, even if one of them dies, it is okay. And he tells Gavin to commit suicide by jumping from the building in front. Now the story comes in the present, so Hollish sees that someone is watching Gavin from the building opposite. Now Hellish sends some officers to search the building in front. Now after some time it is 12 o'clock, so Gavin ends his life by jumping off the building, because he didn't want Joey to hurt Shauna because he truly loved her. On the other hand, the officers reach Joey's house. They arrest Joe and take him away. After this we see Hollish also goes to his wife, because he had also understood that whatever his wife had done was just for his happiness. If you like the video then subscribe the channel. Thanks and bye.